To begin with, in this question, we are asked to complete the square. If we take the letters only, x squared plus 6x, we can complete the square by creating a bracket with x and then a number which is found by halving the number in front of the x only which will be plus 3. So the bracket becomes x plus 3 squared but to make this multiply out to give the original x squared plus 6x we always have to subtract the number inside the bracket, the plus 3, squared. We've also got minus 2 on the end. So this gives us x plus 3 all squared, minus 9, minus 2, and minus 9, minus 2 is minus 11. So the answer is x plus 3 all squared, minus 11 and that's in the format that was asked for moving on to part b we're going to solve the equation no calculator allowed so the assumption is that we're going to use the answer we've just got so we write the equation as x plus 3 all squared minus 11 equals 0 and then our task is to isolate the x so if we add 11 to both sides we get x plus 3 all squared is equal to 11. We need to remove the square, so we square root. This will give us x plus 3 on the left-hand side. And on the right-hand side, we will get the square root of 11. But it's very, very important that we remember that when we square root, we have both a positive and negative possibility. So we write plus minus. So now to get x on its own, we're going to subtract 3 from both sides. We write this number at the front to make the answer look like the format that has been asked for. So we have negative 3 plus or minus root 11. And this is the answer to the question. And the a value is negative 3 and the b value is 11.